Gator and Toad had hardly gone very far when Gator's lamp went out again. Oh, no! What is it, Mr. Gator? Is everything all right? Everything's fine, Toad. It's just my lamp. It's gone out again. Your lamp's gone out? Then you must stop and relight it. It's dangerous to cross the island at night without a light. Yes, I know. But I think there's something wrong with that lamp. It won't stay lit. Gator stopped near a junction to light his lamp again. While he was waiting, James came along with the flying kipper. Making progress, Mr. Gator. We'll soon be at the docks. Gator, where's your lamp? Mr. Gator, is your lamp out again? Yes, I mean, no. Oh, okay, yes, but it doesn't matter. I'm sorry to contradict you, Mr. Gator, but it does matter. You need to stop. I can't keep stopping. I have to get back to the docks before morning. Really, sir, I must insist that you stop and light your lamp. Mr. Gator, please! We are approaching a junction! This is where the cars come on from the gravel pits! There may be gravel on the tracks! Slow down! Right, that's it. Mr. Gator, if you don't stop, then you'll give me a wheel flat! Thank goodness you've seen the light at last. Now, I'm not going any further unless you relight your lamp. Fine. Then I'll go without you. What? It's dangerous to go without a brake van, you know. I know. But it might be quicker and quieter, too. Gator left Toad behind and hurried on towards the junction. Some friends have to say goodbye. Friends like Sam and Logan. Edward and Logan still laugh about Logan's first day when he accidentally gave Gordon the bubblesome cars. 